Hare Krishna, uh, I'm Nandi Muki, and I'm one of the devotees who serve here at Second Avenue. And we just had a festival, so the uh, storefront looks a little uh, much like a warehouse today, but we'll give you a tour just the same. Um, there's, it's only 500 square feet, um, and the surfaces have all been changed. Uh, the ceiling has been replaced with an acoustical tile. The floor has been replaced because there was a rotten spot forward uh, near the asana there. And all the walls have been redone because they were crumbling. This served as a warehouse, a storage room for an antique store for 12 years. And it went to great disrepair, but we've been trying to put it back in some uh, shape or other. And the walls were what before? The walls were plaster on brick, and they, the plaster just crumbled. The bare brick was showing. It was in very bad repair. Um, so it looks presentable now, because we use it as a preaching center, and we also have a few touches to bring out the tear to mood of the place. Old photographs. Um, these on the wall here, this is Prabhupada and Brahmananda uh, exiting from the back apartment, his apartment in the rear, crossing the courtyard, ready to come in for an evening program. This is the sign uh, posting uh, classes, evening classes. Uh, and the bottom pictures of several guests entering for the classes. Um, this is a picture of a wedding. This is Gargamuni's wedding. Jadarani is dancing behind him. Uh, you can see the light in the front door uh, in the back of the devotees. This is Prabhupada seated, I believe, at, on the Bowery. And uh, Prabhupada in Tompkins Square Park. This is Prabhupada. This is the only uh, picture um, showing Prabhupada outside of 2nd Avenue here. This is in San Francisco at the airport. Famous photo. Um, again, Tompkins Square Park. Tompkins Square Park. This is Brahmananda. And I don't know exactly who else is dancing with him. Uh, we, we, we had a kirtan just the other day. Many, many devotees in Tompkins Square Park. It's part of World Harinam Day. This is Prabhupada giving his obeisances. Uh, I believe this is either here in the temple room or in his apartment in the back. I can't tell exactly. It's, these are clips from um, the old Happiness at Second Avenue video. Uh, and this is Prabhupada walking around the East Village alone. What a sight that would have been. And this is Prabhupada seated between these two windows under another Radha Krishna painting, a little later actually than this one. Um, and the curtains over the windows they, they had an interesting way of decorating the storefront just to make it look a little more exotic. And again, this is the same, probably the same evening, Prabhupada giving class. And again, I think this is either in the storefront or in his apartment. I think it must be, I don't know which, actually. Um, and so these are old paintings of, that were painted in 66, 67 by Indira. This is by Indira. And Jadarani. These are Jad, uh, one by Jadarani, another by Jadarani. And this is one of the earliest ones that uh, Prabhupada had Jadarani draw, paint. <coughs> this was painted from a photograph. And the pho there's a photograph of Prabhupada looking at the painting. And the uh, photograph back there, you'll see the very same painting hanging in the very same spot. So that's an accurate location. <coughs> this is another one by Jadarani. And this is by Indira. All 66 and 67, all painted here. Now we're going to go through the door that Prabhupada would enter when he would come for his morning and evening programs. Um, this door, he would come through from his apartment in the back and we'll go through to the courtyard and show you where the apartment is. This is a famous courtyard. 
These three windows are Paul Pod's <coughs> apartment. The window on the fire escape right here in the first floor up was the kitchen. And these two rooms were his front room. And um, some of the same people living in the building at that time are living here now. Um, Prabhupada would come through that door, cross the courtyard. We saw the photograph of uh, Ramananda and he coming through that door, crossing this courtyard, through this door, and entering the door into the temple room. There's a There's a very famous picture of Prabhupada standing next to a bird bath and a bird feeder, and that was taken against this wall.